Hello and welcome to Ron's Gossip. Lana Clarkson. The uh, woman that goes back to murdered. Um, I accept that he probably murdered her. No, it was taking me a few days to get over it. I watched a lot of Lana Clarkson movies. And I watched the Al Pacino and Her Helen Mirren Phil Spector movie as well. But the trial, yeah. Al Pacino is... Um, I don't know, I thought it was going to be ridiculous. Um, Al Pacino in a Bill Spector wig line, but uh, it's actually not, when you watch it, it's not as dark as you think it's going to be. Well, I do wonder. It just goes to show, doesn't it, though? I mean, you know, we've got Bill Spector, he's got plenty of money, he lives as a recluse. Must be pretty sad and lonely, you know, I know I am. And, um, He's, uh, on, on the night that she died, he, uh, she was, she was the third woman he picked up that night. They all refused to go back to his place. She was desperate enough to do it, because she, she's billed as a bad actress. So. What on earth she expected from the situation, I don't know. Apparently she just gave in to him for quite a life. I mean, I can imagine if I was... Lama and I had aspirations of being a, a celebrity of some kind. And I found myself in my awesome years getting nowhere, working as a hostess at the House of Blues, getting picked up by Phil Spector, suddenly realised what I am and what I'm doing. If I was handed a gun by Phil, I'd probably top myself too, I see. But it's been really sad. But I met Lana Clarkson down the pub. I wouldn't take her home. Even if I even if I thought she was emotionally stable enough to be led into my life, I'd still fancy her enough she's passed her. Maybe in the flesh I'd be different, but theoretically it's no, isn't it? But I maybe mean, maybe I mean, it was two thousand and three, wasn't it? Uh, things are different back then. You know, in the 17 years since it happened, we've had Me Too and that kind of thing, and we just wouldn't do it, would we? We just, we just wouldn't do it. You think this situation is not going to, is not going to end well? But what can you do in America? Because prostitution is illegal, isn't it? You know what I mean? We have to go to Nevada, where uh, oh, I don't know, this is probably got some legal weed in. Him. And get down the cat house. But he's probably thinking, well, by not paying her directly, she must really love me. Which is crap, isn't it? It's a farce. Well, Trump's out of the White House, passed off about his foot in the end. Joe Biden's in. Uh, he didn't pardon Julian Assange, which disappoints me, but, you know, Julian Assange is hated by the Assange so much. It's astonishing that the uh, our local judges stopped the extradition. But he has pardoned Little Wayne, which I'm, uh, which I, I suppose I should be happy about, really, because I, I like Little Wayne. I think he's all right. Um, I just think, well, lucky, lucky for Little Wayne, he's a bit he's charmed, isn't he? I can imagine if I was uh, Phil Spector in my castle, and I'd go out, and uh, I'd go out on the town for the night, I'd stop picking up William, trying to persuade him to come home with me to set. If I, if I got one to do it, uh, I've been there before, I've, I've, I've been there in that sort of situation. It is going to end in tears. Something's going through a window. There's going to be guns involved. It's going to be really bad. So that's what you get. You old men, desperate for sex. Failed actresses, alcohol, pills, and guns. It's not going to end well, is it? Let's make it. I didn't. And that is how a legend dies at the end of a pandemic. In a jail. All.
to get his end away with some belly with a yield gun. Let's see. Oh god. I got a case of lamp lobsters myself, that's a weapon. <laughs> 